catch you later, Hansel. Once she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Sometimes she even falls in love with them before she kills them. Finally, just the two of us. Just the two How of us. Feeling? Not bad. Caught a nice nap on this revolving bed. Oh, and welcome to part 17. Bad I was sleeping alone. I'm glad to hear that. This is some bed, all right. I'm about to show you some of its nicer features. Where are my things? Oh, don't worry. They're all there. Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. Someone must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, carrier boy? Yes. So, Metal Gear is armed with a new type of nuclear warhead, huh? Why don't you go ask Campbell for the full story? The Colonel? By the way, you got an optical disc from President Baker, didn't you? What if I did? Is that the only disc? There's no other data? What do you mean? There's no copy? Do not. That's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Wolf must have been feeling generous. But if you want her to stay that way, you better start answering my questions right now. Okay. You were holding one card key. Where are the other two? Dead. What's the Gone. Trick behind Wait. That key? They disappeared. Trick. That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. I see. No problem then. We're going to play a game, Snake. And we'll find out what kind of man you really are. When the pain becomes too great to bear, just give up and your suffering will end. What if you do? The girl's life is mine. Press the circle button. Okay, this is definitely part 16 now. When Hello, everyone. When enough, press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. There are no continues, my friend. Ah! Don't even think about using auto fire, or I'll know. I'm going to run a high voltage electric current through. Well, this is going to be fun. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. You're a tough guy, Snake. But I've got some bad news for you. You're no POW. You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to see you. Just get on with it. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. You should be. Okay. Let's get started. I bet I can't save before this actually starts. In which case, I completely forgot about saving okay, if I killed the Here we go. Alright, welcome to the actual part 16. I am not going to submit this time. Ah! What's this gonna be fun? Shall we go again? Yeah, okay, we'll go again. I'm just gonna button bash for a while now. Uh this is already difficult. Had enough yet? I might be able to survive two more, We're but not finished yet. That's about it. Oh god, this is really painful. Jesus. Uh, uh. You still nope. okay? Want me to go on? No, I'm gonna have to submit, otherwise I will die. Okay. Had enough. So you're human after. I can't beat that. Never been very good at the it. Torture will stop as I promised. But I'll take the woman in return. I'll have my fun with her before I kill Sorry, Meryl's going to die. Well, I hope you can still look at yourself in the mirror, my friend. Looks like I got a roommate. 
Nice. What a stench. Okay, so we now need to escape from prison. What the hell are you doing? Shut up. You saw nothing. Otacon, you're my only hope. Otacon, are you still okay? Yeah, thanks to the stealth camouflage, that is. I have a favor to ask. I need your help. I was wondering when you'd ask. What should I do? I've been captured. I'm locked up here in this cell. What cell? There's a big torture machine nearby. Okay, I know it. It's close. I'll be there right away. Thanks. You better be. You better be, mister. Shut up in there, will ya? No, you! Shut up! What the hell's that? What's going on? Okay. Snake, are you okay? I've been better. How's Mera? Did. Snake, the government has decided not to give in to their demands. We're trying to buy some more time. Come on, Colonel. Why don't you stop playing dumb? I'm sorry about Meryl, but I want the lies to end now. What are you talking about? Metal Gear was designed to launch a new type of nuclear warhead, wasn't it? Oh great, now we've got a false conversation that's going to go on forever. Why did you try to hide it? I'm sorry. Can't tell the grunts, huh? You've changed a lot. Metal Gear, secret advanced nuclear weapons research. Does the White House know about this? How deep does it go? As far as I know, as of yesterday, the President had not been briefed about the Rex project need to know basis is that the idea these are sensitive times even subcritical nuclear tests are causing quite a stir yeah Plus well deniability huh yes and tomorrow the president and his russian counterpart are scheduled to sign the start three accord i get it that's the reason for the death. yeah that's cool and all but i've got a prison to escape that's why we can't let this terrorist attack go public we still haven't even ratified start two or dealt with the issue of tmds this has to do with the president's reputation and America's place as the dominant superpower. So patriotism is your excuse for circumventing the Constitution? Please, Snake. Just stop them. Well, try him, but you're yammering on. Because you're the only one who can. In that case, tell me the truth about this new type of nuclear warhead. I told you before. I don't know the details. I don't believe you. If the situation is so serious, why don't you give in to their demands? Let them have Big Boss's remains. You see? Or is there some reason that you can't do that? It doesn't something exist. you told me about. Publicly, the President has been very vocal in his opposition to eugenics experiments. We don't want the existence of the Genome Army to go public. And that's the only reason? Huh. The hell with you. I'm sorry. The corpse of the DARPA chief is lying right here next to me. Oh, man. But it's strange. He looks and smells like he's been dead for days. All his blood's been drained out, too. Drained? Maybe to slow down decomposition? I have no idea. But the chief only died a few hours ago, right? Right. But he's already started to decompose. What could it all be about? Something in his blood that they wanted? I doubt it. Just the nanomachines in the transmitter. Did the chief tell them his detonation code? I'm afraid so. It looks like they've got both codes and are nearly ready to launch. Damn. Is there any way to prevent it? It seems Never. that there's some type of emergency override device that can cancel out the detonation code. It's a countermeasure that Arms Tech installed secretly. You have to unlock it with three special card keys. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. 
We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. Sorry to have to lay it all in your lap, but you're all I've got. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Naomi, please talk to me. Say something to take my mind off the pain. What can I say? Anything. I... Oh, God. I'm not a very good talker. Please. Tell me about yourself. Myself? That's a tough one. Now we're getting all serious and it's all depressing. That's not a happy topic for me. I don't have any family. No. Wait. Oh, Jesus. There was a man who said he was my father. Where is he? Dead. By my own hand. Oh. Big Boss. What? Big Boss? I had no idea. There was no way you could. It happened in Zanzibar six years ago. Only Snake and I know the real truth of what happened there. So, is it true? Was Big Boss really your father? Who knows? That's what he said. That's all I know. And you were able to kill him? Knowing that? Yep. How? Dark. Wanted. Cold. Besides, some people just need killing. That's petricide. Yep. That's the drama that Mantis was talking about. One we share in common. Is that oh, stop waffling on, please. I've got things to do, it's like escaping a prison. Alone for a while. Alaska was the perfect place. <sighs> Snake. I didn't have a real family either. Just a big brother who put me through school. We weren't even blood related, and he was much older than me. Where is he? He's dead. I'm sorry. Everybody dead, dead, dead. Snake. Is Just like Fred. Alive? After you've been through as many wars as me, it's hard to trust anyone. Hmm. Friends? Roy Campbell. <sighs> You're still calling me friend? Is that it? No. There was another. Frank Yeager. What? Big Boss's most trusted lieutenant. And the only member of Foxhound ever to receive the code name Fox. Gray Fox. I learned a There's lot another of ninja dude. But didn't you try to kill each other? That's true. We did, in Zanzibar. But it was nothing personal. We were just professionals on opposite sides, that's all. And you still call yourself friends? Hard yeah, why not? War is no reason to end a friendship. That's insane. I first met him on the battlefield. He was being held a prisoner of outer heaven, but he didn't look like a prisoner to me. <sighs> he was always so cool and precise. I was still green, and he showed me the ropes. You knew him well? No. We never talked about our personal lives. Sort of yeah, I don't mind like story where it actually goes into story, but this is just going on about random crap at the minute. Barehanded in a minefield. I know it sounds strange to most people, but we were just two soldiers doing our jobs. It's like a sport. Men in their games. You're like wild animals. You're right. We are animals. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? I don't know. <sighs> It's your genes. They make you predisposed towards violence. You really like talking about genes, Naomi. Why did you get into genetic research anyway? Oh my god. I never knew who my parents were, or even what they looked like. I guess I got into genetics because I wanted to figure out why I am the way I am. So you studied about DNA? <laughs> yeah. I thought if I studied my genetic structure, I'd find out who I really was. I thought that by analyzing a person's genetic information, I could retrieve the blank spots in that person's memory. Memory is stored in DNA? We're not sure, but we know that a person's genetic fate is determined just by the sequence of the four bases in their DNA. So what about my fate? You know my DNA sequence, don't you? Your fate? I my fate is we die, or save the world, one of the two. Of course not. You're a scientist, not a fortune teller. Hooray! Alright folks, <laughs> that, that, will, that will be the end of part 16 then, so thank you for joining us.
and see you next time.